course out there, especially the second nine, which you didn't saw for the first time? Um, the course is good. It's, it's penal. You know, if you miss fairways, the rough is very, very thick. Um, yeah, and I didn't, I mean, I hit, hit a few, but uh, I certainly hit a few loose shots and got myself out of position, and, and the golf course does start to to get quite tricky from there, so I um, need to do a better job tomorrow of just put my, putting my ball in play off the tee, uh, and then from there, the, you know, the golf course is still quite scorable. Rory, um, after the last 48 hours, how, how refreshing was it, if anything, to, to get back to golf and just lose yourself in the round of golf? Yeah, um, it was good. You know, Rosie and I said, all right, no chat until lunch so that we can actually concentrate on what we're doing out there. So we started to get into a conversation walking down the first and we're like, no, let's stop this. Let's uh, let's just focus on our golf and, and, and wait to, to say what we want to say when we get when we get inside. So um, it was nice to it was nice to play around the golf and, you know, focus on something else for for those five hours we were out there. And while you're out there, was it I mean, I'm assuming the, the air quality was Hard not, to not, not it, uh, it didn't feel quite as bad as uh, it was on Tuesday, I guess. Um, but yeah, it hasn't been. Uh, I didn't didn't feel it that much today. Right. Um, how was your energy level after the last forty eight hours and the various meetings and phone calls and interviews and everything you've had to do? Um, you know, I, I I got a good night's sleep last night. Um, so, you know, it was nice to, to, to sort of recharge the batteries. I would say my energy levels on uh, Tuesday and Wednesday were diminishing quite quickly. Um, but, you know, I, I slept well last night and honestly felt, you know, it was an early start this morning. Alarm went at 4.15, but um, I, felt, I felt good out there. You know, I'm, I'll take a, you know, do a little bit of practice this afternoon um, and then I'll, I'll get another good night's sleep tonight and, you know, I'll be, I'll be fine. Hey Rory, uh, the, uh, the events of the past week, have they perhaps concerned you that you put your faith in maybe an altruistic version of the PGA Tour that doesn't exist, at least maybe not anymore, and, and maybe you need to look after yourself a little more? Yeah, I'm, uh, I, I, not that, I wouldn't say I viewed the PGA Tour as, you know, through that altruism lands per se I mean it's at the end of the day this is business and um, my job is playing golf at the end of the day so you know the more that I can focus on that and focus on you know the birdies and the bogeys instead of the stuff that's happening in, in the boardroom you know I'll, I'll be much happier. Do you have more pressure on the golf course or off right now? Uh, off, I you know the most uncomfortable I've felt over, I'd say in the last 12 months was my press conference yesterday. I sort of wish I had asked this yesterday, but um, do you uh, have any thoughts or sort of interest in, in getting to know or, or have any familiarity with um, the new chairman of, of the joint venture, um, Yasser? Um, I, I know I know Yasser. And I mean, have you talked to him? Played golf with with him at all? Any? Yeah. Any, so I yeah. I played a pro am with Yasser. Um, in Dubai a few years ago, and then I've seen him. I I was with him at a Formula One race randomly a couple of years ago in Austin. Um, I saw him in Dubai at the end of last year. You know, so it's I've you know he's obviously been in and around the golf world and, and obviously the wider sports world. So um, you know he sort of you know he 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 runs in the same circles as a, as a lot of people that I know. Can I ask how 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 is he as a golfer? And then maybe any other impressions of him, sort of just just as a guy. Uh, I would say he's an avid golfer. I think he really does like the game of golf. He he likes playing it. Um, he's a very impressive man. Harvard Business School runs seven or eight hundred billions worth of dollars and invested in a ton of different companies. And you know he's a very smart, impressive man. Thanks, Russ. Thank you.